Good morning, Erica. And what a frightening situation. This happened at around 10.30 p.m. late last night, right off of Donna Drive. You could still see that parts of the plane are launched into this home. You could see that part of the wing and also tail of that plane right in the middle of it. You could also see lots of debris scattered all over the place. A police say that at least two people were inside the plane when it happened. They were able to escape and they have non life threatening injuries. Investigators say people were also inside the home when this crash happened. We are waiting to get an update on exactly how many people were inside and what their current condition is at the moment. But I did get a chance to speak to a neighbor who lives directly across from this home who spoke to me. He said that he was watching TV and all of a sudden he heard this big loud boom at around 1030 last night. Take a listen to this. And uh, we heard a big bang. Uh, I got up slowly, but by the time I actually came out to look around in the front yard, we had all of the uh, fire departments already here. They had fantastic response. I couldn't ask for anything better in this small town of ours. But uh, I saw my neighbor, which lived right next to me, and she actually opened the door before anybody showed up, because she heard a bang too. And from what she told me, she saw a couple of people running around with flashlights yelling and saying, get out of the way, get run, run away, because we didn't know what was going on. And back here live in Groton, you can still see that incredible uh, damage there. Uh, the neighbor also telling me that uh, the homeowner, he actually just built the garage that you're looking at right now. So to see this was just uh, really frustrating for a lot of the neighbors because it's a very tight knit community. But once again, some incredible damage that we're looking at right now. We're still waiting to get an update on the condition of those individuals or individual who may have been inside the home. But as soon as we get any more information, we'll make sure to take that information live on air, but also online. We're live in Groton, Lisette Nunez, Fox 61 News.